I think it's about time I did something electrical. I want the whole front of the house completely lit up. Let's do this. This is the RGB light strip we're going to be using. It is IP65, meaning it's weather sealed. And it's quite a nice, heavy, sturdy thing. I think this will look really nice outside, but we've got to test it, so uh, we'll do that now. Okay, so for testing, here we go. We have the positive connected through to the multimeter positive, and the negative connected through to the negative on the multimeter. Now if you undo this plug here, inside you'll find a little potentiometer which you can adjust with a screwdriver. Now when I switch this on, the voltage should go up to 36 volts which is indicated there, 4.2 amps. However I know that the lights that we're using are actually 42 volts plus, up to 48. But they seem to work fine at 42, so um, and voltage is below that. So um, I'll just show you this going all the way down. And if I turn it up the other way, we manage to find 42.53 seems to be the maximum. So that's where we leave it. And I've worked out that each of these wires correspond to each of the colours in the light bar. So we can light each of these individually. So if I turn the power supply on, we can light up each of the colours, red, green and blue. There you go. So that's red. There's your green. And there's your blue. I'm not sure why they wired it that way around when you can see that the wire there is green and it lights up blue. And you've got a blue wire which lights up green. Strange. Anyway, the red is on orange, which I guess is kind of logic. If we wire all of these three together, like this, in theory we should have something that resembles white. To me that looks a bit pink. But I think that will do the job, and it looks quite nice. I think what we'll do is we'll leave it at maximum output, because I want the whole front of the house to be really bright when I come home. So. Next we need to check the PIR. This is the PIR. This is coming in from mains. There's the light. And here's the wiring diagram for the people that like to see it in a diagram. Live, neutral, load. There you go. Quite simple. And now just to test it. When you first power these PIRs on they will Turn the lamp on just to check that the circuit is all working. So here we go. 